A global pandemic is uh, sweeping across the country. The government has ordered schools, businesses, stores to close. Everybody is quarantined in their homes. And of course, you, the great teacher, is going to wonder, how am I going to keep my students learning during this time? On Teacher Connection, federal and state health officials have told me that such a pandemic is a question of when and not if. Such officials are concerned that teachers uh, and schools need to be prepared to continue learning in case such a quarantine is required by the government. While the uh, potential for a pandemic is uh, not very probable, uh, the reason classes may be canceled for any length of time is usually going to be weather. Just this year, uh, Hurricane Harvey uh, created a lot of havoc in the Houston area. Last year, uh, Hurricane Matthew in uh, my area in uh, Bluffton Hilton Head uh, shut down schools for weeks. Um, and so that threw everybody really behind. This year when we had to uh, potentially evacuate for Hurricane Irma, uh, I was better prepared. I had a little bit of lead time and had thought the matter through. Therefore, I had uh, an assignment and a method of communicating with my students already set up. I've started vlogging as you can see uh, and I did it to my students, sharing the videos on uh, Google Classroom with them, uh, letting them know that uh, everything's okay and that uh, I did want them to continue their learning. For instance, I started having them shoot uh, photographs for an upcoming project that they were going to have. The time they would be out, and especially if they uh, had evacuated to other areas, would give them a good opportunity to take these photographs for the project. Before the evacuation, I was able to ask my students that they were going to have internet access to wherever they were going to go. Also, I encouraged them to take their uh, school tap. I explained to my students that I wanted them to check uh, Google Classroom daily uh, for any messages that I would uh, send to them uh, regarding any assignments. Also, the assignments themselves would probably be posted on Google Classroom as well. Fortunately, we were only gone for two and a half days, but it did give students some time uh, to work on this project, which uh, helped them when it came time to turn the project in. This means to uh, teachers that you need to have a plan uh, for what you're gonna do if you should be out for any length of time due to uh, weather related or any other kind of uh, uh, situation which uh, will close your school for any length of time. Make sure you uh, communicate that plan with your students and your parent. Even if you happen to be out for just a day or two, put your plan into effect test it out, make sure it works, and take what you learn from that and make adjustments uh, as needed. Hopefully you won't have the need uh, to invoke a long-range uh, plan to keep learning going in the case of some disaster or pandemic, but it never hurts to be prepared. If you like this video, click the like button below. Also, if you like this content and want more, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.